out and today I'm going to be taking you behind the scenes of American Girl History's J Release launch day. So I think without further ado, let's get started! Welcome to how messy Mal's desk is at the moment. <laughs> Here we are, what in the world is that? What's that? <laughs> Interesting! That's the first time I've seen that on the website, now I'm worried. <laughs> So let me explain to you what we're doing right now to prepare for the relaunch that's supposed to happen at 5. It's currently like 3 something. So first of all, usually on launch day, I go through all the pages that we're going to publish that's going to be out for the launch. I check to see if there's anything that's spelled in incorrectly. I read like the paragraphs and the fun fact stuff out loud. And I make sure all the layouts look good, that they're the right layout that everything else is and then I go through all the images to see if the images are good if there's anything that's like really bad quality image wise then Wix actually has this thing where you can click it and like it's this like little feature that they have and it could like improve the quality of the image so it doesn't look like really bad so that's what we have to do plus we have to write a blog post at some point and then we have to put in the little new section on the home page that it was updated June release happened. Not, why did I say the June release? It's the J release. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Anyways, so yeah, that's what we are doing at the moment. And we had to make sure all this stuff gets done by five today. Pressure's on, guys. Pressure, pressure, pressure's on. It's currently 4.03, and the website is supposed to, everything's supposed to be done in an hour. We're still on Julie's page putting things where they need to go. Everything's done with Jess and Joss. Julie's taking forever and we still have Josefina's to do. So actually we are reordering things. So what I've done for all the pages is that I reordered every single item that's on the page to make it like look good, you know? Not like it's like all just jumbled on there and stuff. So yeah, because there's a certain order kind of theme that I like to do when it comes to like all the clothing and stuff and the accessories taking forever oh my goodness it has literally given me a message Shane Paige cannot respond so many times and I'm like I can't we can't do this right now so I'm a little bit stressed out but it's fine anxiety but it's fine see and then it'll just just freeze like this oh goodness so it's just it's been a train wreck right now. It's It really has. I really hope it all comes together for us here within the next hour. We'll see because I still have to um, check Julie's information and stuff. I like to read over it, like I said. Then we have to do all the same thing to Josefina. And if, see, look, page unresponsive. It literally gives me this message. It literally gives me that message all the time. And I'm just like, we, no, we're not doing that right now. We, we're, we're not, we're responding. We have to respond. I'll let you know my progress. We'll see. Okay, so it's 4.57. I didn't get to what I wanted to add to Josefina's page, but it's okay. I'm literally going to publish the website because I'm going to stick to my word on that they're, that they're going to be on AGH at 5 o'clock. Hopefully it published quick. I'm really about to cry, y'all. <laughs> I'm so stressed out and things just not, didn't go well. Technology is just not on my side anymore. I'm going to cry, but it's fine. It's now 5 o'clock and um, it's still, still trying to publish. Oh my god are they even on there see guys this is what i'm dealing with right now um lovely computer problems that we're having lately <sighs> it's been a while since i talked to you let me spill the tea yes everything is up on the website i did manage to get it up i got everything up on the website at 11 o'clock at night that friday night yeah uh, crazy. It took that long with technical difficulties and stuff, but honestly, I'm glad that it's up. It was, it, it was exhausting. It was, it was tiring, but hey, at least it's up. At least it's good, alright? So, 
yeah, I definitely recommend going and checking it out if you haven't done so already because everything's up, it looks good, and yeah, it looks, it looks stunning. So, I'm so sorry that you guys had to witness a lot of the, you guys didn't even witness a lot of the technical difficulties, honestly. If you thought that was a lot in the video, girl. <laughs> Anyways. Thanks for watching this video, everyone. Don't forget to subscribe and follow me and follow American Girl History, all of all of me, I guess I should say. I don't really know how to end, how to say it, um, on social media. Um, check out American Girl History. Link is down below. And if you're watching this on uh, the American Girl History Instagram, then link is in our bio. Um, and be sure to check American Girl History out and stuff like that. I'll link all the I'll link the website and all of our social media stuff down below. Be sure to check me out. Um, I'm the creator of American Girl History. I make YouTube videos and post on Instagram and stuff. My user my usernames and stuff is Dollies and Rainbows. So please go check my YouTube channel out and my Instagram and stuff. So. Yeah, give this video a like if you enjoyed it. Comment down below what your favorite thing from the release was or what you learned, something that you might have learned. I had a lot of fun making this and I've, even though I've collected American Girl dolls for over, oh, is it, how long has it been? Oh my God, it's been 12 years now. Girl. <laughs> wow, I'm getting old. Anyways, um, I still learn stuff new every day and that's what I love, you know? I think that's it. I'll see you next time. Bye!